Hello and welcome to Sonos Computer Crunch. Today I'm going to be showing you how to enable the HTTP API within the ComputerCraft config. This is the job of the server administrator if they want to be able to use the pastebin command in-game. This pastebin command will allow you to download ComputerCraft scripts directly off of pastebin, which is the pretty much the only way for a general user on a multiplayer server to download and install my scripts, unless they want to type it out in the turtle, which can be a bit of a pain. I will also show you how to use this pastebin command in-game. Alright, so um, let's get started. As a server administrator, all you need to do to enable HTTP API within ComputerCraft is to go to your server files, locate your server files, go into configurable files or config, um, open up the ComputerCraft CFG. I'm using Notepad++. Locate this line. Enable the HTTP API on computers. This line needs to be changed from what it says to after the equal sign true. And then save this. Control S or click up here. Save this file, close it, and you're pretty much good to go. Lo uh, boot up the server and you should be able to use the HTTP API in game. All right, so we made it onto the server. So uh, now I'm going to show you how to use this pastebin program. Now, in order to use this paste uh, pastebin program, you need to have an ID of the program that you want to install. So let me show you how you get that ID. So if you look down in the chat, I've pasted the uh, I've pasted the URL for my branch program on pastebin. The ID of the program you want to download is the last couple of digits here. What you have to do is you have to copy these uh, last after this uh, backspace you need to get uh, this. This is the ID of the program. Alright so I'm gonna cut that from the uh, URL and now I have the ID in my um, clipboard. Alright so uh, let's place down a turtle. The first thing you need to do uh, is optional but recommended. You label your turtle. So what we do is we say label, set, and um, I have a habit of labeling all my slaves Ertagon 15, so that's what I'm going to do in this case. Now this computer is named Ertagon 15. This means that if I pick it up, it's unique and it will keep the programs and the fuel and all of that. But it won't stack with other turtles. Okay, so now we use pastebin, get, then the ID of the program you want to download, and what you want to name the program on the turtle. Press enter, and now it has downloaded the script and installed it onto the turtle automatically. Next, you need to do whatever the program says. So let's try to type branch. It says usage branch length. We need to provide it with coal, cobblestone, and torches in this order. And we do branch. Let's just do 10, just for example. And here it goes. Thank you for watching, guys. And um, I'll see you in the next one. Remember, if you have any questions, feel free to ask them in the comments below. If uh, you enjoyed this video, please leave a like. I really, really, really appreciate that. And yeah, as I said, I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.